So I was just talking about this, right? So Samsung changed a lot with the Galaxy Z Fold 7's cover screen light. This is like the main highlight right here. Samsung changed up the Galaxy Z Flip 7 a lot this year, bro. Like I'm telling y'all, like you, I mean, you can see right here, like they, they did a lot like between like making it beyond like the cameras and everything. And they just added a bunch of features up on you. So with that being said, I got to go and show you everything that you can do with your Galaxy Z Flip 7's cover screen. Cause it's a lot to do with it. And like you could do a lot of stuff without even having to open up your phone. A lot of quick stuff. All right, so yeah, Samsung really came through with the heat with the Galaxy Z Flip 7. Like it even changed a lot from the Z Flip 6, man. And I wish I had a Z Flip 6 to show y'all, but here, look at this Google image I just pulled up. As you can see right there, yeah, big difference, right? But yeah, let me go and show you everything that you can do with the Galaxy Z Flip's cover screen. So we're gonna start off by actually opening up the phone and show you all the settings up in here. So if you wanna go manage your Z Flip's cover screen, go to settings, scroll down, and look for cover screen right there. Or you could just search it too, but go and click on that. And as you can see, we have all this going on right here. We have these widgets too. Well, they're not really widgets, but they're pages. So you can see that we could just flip through all these right here. We got this dog, we got this over here. We have the rainbow, we have a lot going on man we have a lot of customization oh yeah i remember this one so let me fold this up i actually had this i think it was with my z flip six or something like that so it seems like it doesn't automatically apply if you just go ahead and do that but if you cycle through these let me go and click on that and as you can see we have this like kind of glitter design or whatever you want to call that if i click on done now it says apply to cover screen if i go and fold that up as you can see right there, we have this. So it's pretty dope. And you can just manage it like that too. Now we can always add new if we go and click on this. And we have a bunch of different designs over here. So if we go and click on that, we have everything we saw earlier. And then we have a gallery. So you can go and add a video or a picture or you can download something. You can go ahead and create with AI. So if I go to generate, I can go ahead and just make my own AI wallpaper. As you can see, we have photo ambience. So I can just go ahead and go through that if I want to. So if I go and click on this, we can see the weather. So uh, let's see here. Let me do uh i guess it's just a random picture i did at mcdonald's right so let me go and click on that so basically it's going to use ai to let you know if it's raining or snowing or whatever else like that so that's pretty dope and i can go and click on this at the top where it says battery and i can show the battery icon right there and let's go and play this so let's just go ahead and see what this looks like we're just going to go ahead and do this ai galaxy ai so as you can see right there now it's raining here in my picture so that's dope and then with these other ones you can go and change it up to like the variations so we have a bunch of different variations i can go ahead and change like this right here i can just go and click through all these different options i can change the clock and i can go and change this icon here in the corner for whatever i want i can click on this plus icon here on the left side and then we can go ahead and add something else too like we can add a dot or we can just add the notifications here at the top left. And then if we go to manage over here, I can just go ahead and choose whatever ones I wanna remove. So when I'm just swiping through all these cover screens, I don't gotta go ahead and just swipe through all these. But we also got widgets over here. So this is like the new big thing that Samsung really added to this cover screen. So we got a lot going on. So I got the weather and I got my now briefing right now, but I can add a whole bunch of different stuff. Like I can add a calculator too. Let me go put that right there, a two by two. And I can go ahead and add, uh, let's see here, a dual clock. So if I'm traveling, I could do that. and as you can see right there looking dope i can remove it if i want to chicago and london i don't even live in chicago or i could just go to another app so we do have third-party support like spotify so if i go and click on this i can just go ahead and get my own page here for spotify and i could just manage it like this so yeah that's dope that spotify actually managed this for the z flip cover screen so i'm pretty sure our app has to actually support the z flips cover screen widgets so i'm pretty sure it's gonna be pretty limited man like i'm not even gonna lie to y'all but we have like smart things over here i can go and manage my smart home we have outlook so i can do that too we got samsung notes we have multi-star we have google we have a lot of stuff going on here and i could just go ahead and add my app so i have that too here i'll show you that in a second but i mean like i keep adding stuff and it seems like we can have pretty much as many pages as we want so i just been like going ahead and scrolling through these and like yeah it's not really stopping yet and now on my cover screen i just got my video ideas so if i want to just go ahead and just turn on my phone like this and scroll all the way to the end oh wait there we go so scroll all the way to the end i could check out my video ideas real quick now i gotta open my phone so that's pretty trash but i mean we do got that that's cool you also got over here that you can manage your cover screen's timeout so i can change this up to 30 seconds or as little as five seconds and notifications and that's about it so you can set your show notifications show notification pop up even while screen is off and then you got quick responses and then also this here if i back out of here real quick and go to always on display i can go and turn on the always on display and it will also apply to the cover screen too so if i go ahead and leave that on right there always on display it's just gonna stay on like that so that's cool that we got to always on display for the cover screen too now let me go and show you everything with the cover screen itself so we have our notifications i don't have any notifications right now but you can just go ahead and manage it if you want to like i think i showed you earlier i 
can press and hold on to this to go ahead and manage my pages or whatever so as you can see we have all this going on so that's pretty dope and you can also do this so if i go ahead and tap on this and swipe to the middle you can just go ahead and see all our pages so we got a big overview of what's going on right there that's pretty dope again if you want to go and do that just swipe from the right side to the middle and then you can see all your pages right there. And then if I want to, as you can see, I can go and shuffle them around and do whatever I want, so dope. But I showed you all those widgets and everything, so like we got the weather over here. I could just manage my whole big weather screen. I could look through all that, so that's pretty dope. I got my now briefing, so I could scroll through this if I want to and see whatever else is going on in my day. I got the calculator, so I could just do some quick calculations and it doesn't even have to load or anything. I got Spotify, so I could just go ahead and listen to my music. Oh, wait, let me go and open this up real quick. I can go and pull up some Baby Tron. I mean, come on, bro. It's Baby Tron, man. If you ain't on that Baby Tron wave, you behind right now. We got some 414 Big Frank. You know what I'm saying? Not Milwaukee music. Gotta represent, right? Ah, yeah. We have the Good Lock Launch over here. So I can actually add any app that I want downloaded on my phone. It's actually really dope. I'll show you how to do that in a second. But yeah, you can add any single app that you want. It's limited, though. So you can't literally add every single app on your phone. You're like kind of limited by the amount of apps that you can have on there. But you could choose any app that you want. Let's see what else we got over here. We have some more widgets. Like we got the battery widget. We have my timer widget. Like I was just telling y'all, like I'm a fat ass, bro. Like that's just how it is. I use this a lot for my ear fryer. I have an analog clock. So that's pretty dope. Let me go and scroll over here we have the labs feature so this is samsung's version well i guess good luck is samsung too but we have like the native feature for the actual recovery screen so i can actually natively use these apps over here now now let me scroll over here real quick it pretty much works the same except it's just cut off here at the bottom i can go to messages i can go to google maps both of those is looking kind of crazy i'm not really trying to show my location so i ain't really gonna do that i'm not trying to have one of y'all find my address and try to pull up or something like that like <laughs> just don't do that bro fafo that's all i gotta say anywho as you can see over here like i got my widgets and everything that i just added so you could do a lot going on with this and we even have game snacks so look at this i could play games on the cover screen bro who would have thought that's crazy right i think we had this with the last flip too but why would i want to do this like i said though you can also do that with the good lock launch over here and if i go scroll up so if i go ahead and just swipe up like that i can get to the home screen i also got samsung pay y'all you can use samsung pay on your z flips cover screen i could pay with my fingerprint now you could just go ahead and take that if you want because the gift card don't even work but this is pretty dope man we have my memberships and everything i could pull up my triple a planet fitness Myers, subway like piggly wiggly we got all this going on and then of course i could just tap my phone with my credit card or my debit card just like that and then it'll work i'll tell y'all bro it's kind of trippy when you actually in the grocery store or whatever else just paying with your z flip man like they don't expect that also we have the camera over here so if we swipe on that you can utilize the clearest camera on this phone so we can just go ahead and get to 0. 0.6 times 2 times 10 we could do whatever we want with the camera i could pull this up and change the resolution or whatever else i want to i could swipe through here and i can get to video and i can go and get to portrait and i could just pull up my gallery too also if you see here if i go and pull up this camera and go and click on this button here it's right at the top so click on that as you can see if you take a picture of somebody they can see themselves too so that's a nice feature too we can also swipe down and we can get to everything going on over here so i got my wi-fi vibration my airplane mode we can't customize this though as far as i could tell but we have my brightness and everything like we got everything that we need right here it's pretty nice and we even have screen recording for the cover screen i didn't even know about that but you can screenshot too now let me go and show you how you can get full apps on your cover screen for the z flip so there's two ways you can do it the samsung way where they give you like three apps i don't know why you want to do that or you can use good lock so i'll go ahead and show you the samsung way first just because so we can go over here to display i think it's display or no sorry it's advanced features and then go to labs and then you can see it right here so we have apps allowed on cover screen labs so we have three apps that's pretty much all they give you so we can also get multi-star to get more apps like i was just telling y'all so in order to do that you can go and click on get multi-star and it's going to just bring me to this because i already got it downloaded but you're going to go to the galaxy store right so go to the galaxy store and then just go ahead and search up good luck you're gonna look it up and it's gonna probably look like this or they might have changed the app icon by now but i'm gonna go and click on open and you're gonna get this right here so this is gonna be good luck and then you can see right here we got multi-star so go and click on the download button next to multi-star and when it downloads just go and click on that and then we have it right here iheart galaxy foldable and as you can see we have launcher widgets so that's where you get all your apps so you can just click on pretty much any app that you got downloaded on your phone and you can just pull it all up so i could literally pull this up i could go over here let's see uh let's go to uh let's see citizen maybe actually no let's not do citizen it might pull up my location again so let's go to you know what let's go to covers i want to order some covers on my cover screen bro yeah look at that 
And now I can go and click on this icon right here too. So you can see that the camera is clearly covering up some of the buttons. So I can go and click on that and adjust it too if I want to. And what's funny is that if I have Fortnite on here, I can literally play Fortnite on my Z Flip 7's cover screen. Like it's possible. I did it before. I did a YouTube Shorts on it on the older Z Flip. And y'all, that's going to be the things that you can do with the cover screen on your Z Flip 7. So it's actually pretty nice to all the things that you can do with the Z Flip 7's cover screen. You got a lot of screen to work with. So I mean, naturally, you would kind of want all that. And it's cool that you do. But let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. But I'm out to go and get up out of here, man. So appreciate you for watching. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, go and give this video a like. And if you really liked it, go and subscribe. Go and follow me on my social media. Eddie Centic on Instagram and X and Facebook and Instagram. And Wait, hold on. I screwed that up. Follow me on social media. Eddie Centic on Instagram and X and Facebook, but Instagram and X are most active. I'm talking way too fast, bro. And I'm telling y'all, like, I love this Z Flip 7, man. It's such a dope phone, man. Like, I, I love everything about it. Like, you have the face unlock and everything. I can unlock it with my fingerprint. Like, it's a cool phone for sure. Samsung really came a long way with these Galaxy Z Flips. The Fold too, but the Z Flip especially, like, man, look at this cover screen right here. That's the cover screen on the original Z Flip, or the Z Flip 5G anyway. But with that being said, man, I got way more videos to go ahead and record, so I'm about to go ahead and be busy this next month, man. It's gonna be wild. Anyway, man, you be smooth, and I'm gonna get it with you later. Peace out.